to what's going on with it be coming back with another one let's get it we're gonna talk some boxing we had a fight in the lightweight division george Cambosis versus maxi hughes he had a controversy win yeah it was a questionable win majority decision and not only did the fans boo but shakur stevenson he was at the fight and he had a lot to say himself he pressed george Cambosis after the fight shakur stevenson I know a lot of people are gonna say, shit, Shakur Stevenson should be worrying about, you know, Devin Haney, you know, taking that 25%. That's what George Cambosa said himself. You need to worry about Devin Haney. But what I love about Shakur Stevenson, if the judge is not going, you know, give the right call, he'll call him out. He felt Devin Haney lost the fight to Lomachenko, which I, you know, felt it could have went either way as well. Where you could have had Lomachenko win in that fight for sure. You know, but Shakur Stevenson he called George Kimbosis out. He said, you didn't win that fight. He said, I'll stop you. He said, I'll stop you. He said, I'm not, I'm not Devin. That's what Shakur Stevenson said. Yeah, but it was a questionable decision. Jordy decision over Max Hughes, and I get it. George Kimbosis is the more marketable fighter. They want to set up the fight for, you know, Lomachenko. That's what George Kambosa said he wants to fight, but check out what Shakur Stevenson had to say. He was talking some smack. He pressed George Kambosa after the win last night. Check it out. Hey, if they, if they don't fight me, we can make it happen. If they don't fight me, Bad as these judges are, they can't blame the boxing fans for streaming these fights and not ordering a pay per view. Boxing is done. You see how long they, if you watch the fight, you see how long they took the, you know, bring the scorecards in and give the final decision. Boxing is corrupt. It's been corrupt, but it's right in our face now. You can't blame the boxing fans for, you know, streaming these fights. There's no point in ordering a pay per view. If a, a fighter can win the fight right in front of everyone and they'll give the decision to you know who's the more marketable fighter who is the money on things like that especially if the fighter doesn't get knocked out boxing is crazy maxi hughes the southpaw he's gritty he's tough he's countering george Kambosis all night with the left hooks overhand rights maxi hughes he was he was fighting. He fought on the back foot very well. George Cambosa. He didn't look he didn't look good. His coaches even said it. He said he he didn't look good. Let's be real. He didn't look good, let's be real. Yeah, Shakur Stevens, he be pressing these guys, man. Listen to him. I ain't gonna lose to him, but come on. I want to be honest. Nah, I thought you were I definitely want to see him fight. I 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 want to see him
George can bust get by 21 and what two now? George can bust is two losses to Devin Haney. 135 cooking up. 135 cooking up Devin Haney. He has to fight either. Regis Progress. They're saying Shakur Stevenson. So cooking up for you know Devin Haney, what he's gonna do at 140 for Regis Progress. He's going Fight Shakur Stevenson at 135. So, see how it play out. Lomachenko, George Kambosos look like that fight's gonna be 135 now. Got Terrence Crawford, Earl Spence next week. Gonna break that fight down this week. So, got some boxing. You know, I'm gonna keep the fire coming. I'm gonna break it down. Let me know what y'all think about this. George Kambosos get a gift from the judges or did he hold Maxi Hughes off? Let me know what y'all think. You know, I ain't gonna stop. Hit that bell icon if you guys come so rapid, so consistent, you will miss one. You know, I love it. It's knocking another one out. Bah, bah, bah. Let's get it.